The fall corn harvest is in full swing, and with almost 4,000 acres of cropland and 400 dairy cows to work, a Minnesota farmer has to make every minute count. No, it's just not my wildest dreams. <laughs> I didn't think we'd even be this big. Dale and Marlis Hinckley built this successful dairy with 30 years of sweat and hard work. Sons Adam and Matt are officers of the family farm and will someday take over. Adam returned to the farm after going to college, manages the farm's employees, and is taking over the dairy herd. But oldest son Matt was determined to be a farmer early on. When I went to, went to kindergarten for the first day, I came home. We were all sitting around the supper table and we asked him how his day was. And I told my mom and dad that I wasn't going back the following day. <laughs> and they said, what do you mean? He laid his fork down on his plate and he said, well guys, I've decided I'm quitting school because I'm gonna farm with you. Mom and dad convinced Matt to finish high school. Then he became a student of the farm and his father. Boy. <laughs> What did he teach me? <laughs> Probably everything I know. <laughs> you know, just take care of people and, and uh, treat people the way you want to be treated. As with most farm kids, both boys were driving a tractor before they were teenagers and always watching and learning from their parents. Well, from my mom and dad, I've learned quite a bit. As a child, everything from milking a cow, feeding a calf, Mom and Dad have built a business from the ground up. This farm has, wouldn't be what it is if they wouldn't have put their heart and soul into it. This is something that Morris and I have taken and built on, and we just want to keep it in the family for them to build on and to keep it going. Dale and Marlis are proud of what they've built at Hinkley Holsteins. Like most dairy farmers, they had to fight to survive in the early years. What got them through was a strong faith and the inspiration that comes when you're surrounded by life. If you've never experienced it, you really can't describe what it feels like, you know, to, to see a little baby calf and watch her, you know, as she's, as she's growing each and every day. I don't know, maybe it's the mother in me too, I don't know. It's a, a sense of pride, a sense of accomplishment. At Hinkley Holsteins, steady growth has come from working hard and working smart. We actually utilize technology from probably one end to the other. LED lighting is used in the freestall barn to conserve energy and improve cow comfort. A robotic calf feeder helps to monitor growth and wellness. A tracking software helps the Hinkleys manage feed usage, shrink loss, and costs. Even the tractors and combines used to plant and harvest the crops are guided by GPS satellites to conserve fuel and prevent the overuse of fertilizer. All these technologies help us improve our yield as a whole, whether it be on our grain side or on our dairy side. In order to get the most out of everything, you need to do the best management. Both Matt and Adam are quick to acknowledge they never would have had this opportunity without their parents. You know, I probably don't thank them enough for that because now that has allowed me the opportunity and my brother the opportunity to be a part of growing a business and then someday to continue to grow on with our generations to come. I'm very grateful that I can, you know, I did have the opportunity to stay. Now that Dale and Marlis have set the path forward, sometimes they like to take a minute to look back. We can see the whole farm from this spot. It's kind of a way to look back and say, you know, all of our hard work has paid off. And it gives you a good feeling that at some point in time you can turn the whole thing over and it's still gonna operate again. And it's through the family.